you're gonna be a little bit more insulated to it. Business-wise, they said to make sure that you have long-term debt fixed on assets that have cash flow. Because as the stock market tanks and there's really little cash flow, as all of these troubling times come up, if you have a good piece of property in a good area that's providing you cash flow, then you'll be able to ride the storm and not worry about interest rates constantly rising on you. So one of the things that I try to explain to my clients that are afraid of debt, they say that, you know, debt's scary. I said, well, debt could be good. You know, there's good fat and bad fat. You know, you eat an avocado, it has a lot of fat, but it's good fat. So debt can be good. So if you have a low interest rate mortgage, say you got an interest rate, a 3% interest rate mortgage when rates were low mm -hmm. for 30 years. Today, that's not a liability, that's an asset. Your liability is your house because mm -hmm. house values are going to tank could tank. But the 3% mortgage gives you the position to say, I don't care because I'm going to live here. I got a really low payment. It doesn't matter what happens in the rest of the world. I've solidified my position. So another thing I did previously, I said ordered solar panels. I put solar panels on. I didn't feel it was the best ROI on my money, but it gave me insurance to say, I am going to have a fixed electric bill, a fixed cost where I can have that fixed cost and have less things to worry about. So it's really important to prepare yourself in such a way where setting yourself up with cash flow coming in, fixing your debt, fixing your expenses, putting yourself in a good position that you won't feel the turmoil as much. You're gonna be a little bit more insulated to it.